What's up, y'all? And welcome back to another video. So I'm super excited to make this video because it has been a long time since I made a productive video. And this Sunday, your girl got up and I commenced to cleaning and organizing. I was just in that spirit. So I thought, well, let me turn on my camera and show you guys, you know, how I spend a productive Sunday. So as you can see, I'm starting with the dishes because I was tired on Saturday and I just wanted to chill. So I did not wash my dishes. And when I wake up in the morning, I cannot stand a sink full of dishes. So before I can make breakfast and even drink my coffee, I gotta clean the dishes. A part of um, a productive Sunday for me is pretty much making my life easier for the week. So I like to wash my um, fruit and have it already clean and ready to go so that then during the week I could just go in the refrigerator and get whatever I want to eat and I don't have to worry about washing anything and I think that's why I end up throwing away so many fruits and vegetables because I be lazy and I don't want to wash it so it just sits and goes bad so I just figured that this would be an easier way for me to really be forced to eat it because it's already clean I put it in a bowl and it's ready to go. So if you've been watching my videos, you know I said I'm trying to stay away from Starbucks because I spend a lot of money there. So I decided to get this holiday blend from Starbucks so that I could still feel like, you know, I'm still getting my Starbucks, but I'm saving money by making coffee at home. So I was super excited to refill my coffee container with this new blend. And um, I'm actually sipping on it now and it's pretty good, but it's strong. You gonna feel like you could fly drinking this coffee. <laughs> sip sip of my coffee and now it's time to clean up so I'm first gonna take down these Halloween decorations because I didn't have these up a week after Halloween because that's me just like with Christmas decorations I have mine up way past New Year's and all of that because I hate taking down decorations so I'm finally taking down these bats on the wall and um, I had some little pumpkins and ghosts hanging that I also got down. Um, and that's it. I really didn't decorate this year for Halloween because I hate taking decorations down. And I know that I'm going to go overboard for Christmas. So I was a little bit of a light decorator for Halloween. Let me kiss it slow. degrees, way too cold. So hold me down. Well, I see you at the show tonight. Thank you. 
little area there should be nothing on this little counter or whatever you want to call it basically like all our towels and stuff go in those cabinets and for whatever reason I pick up all my stuff from all over the house and it ends up here <laughs> and I do not know why so I made sure that this Sunday I got all that crap from under there and put everything where it should go because all of my junk just ends up there it's so crazy this is my guest bedroom and just like that little counter area all of my stuff goes on this bed i have a problem y'all i will change my clothes and just throw them on the bed instead of putting them in the dirty clothes or folding them up putting them in the closet they just end up on this bed and then by the end of the week i have a pile so i'm making sure that i get all my stuff up but comment below if you're like that like instead of you putting your clothes up where they should go they end up on your bed or the floor i don't know why i do that tip of mine um, that I would recommend is to use these garment bags. Um, so a lot of stuff like you may go to the dry cleaner for your blazers or like your trousers. But what I use is this garment bag from the laundress and I put all those type of clothes in that bag, zip it up. And then I just wash those clothes on perm press. And I've never had any of my clothes ruined and this works instead of going to the dry cleaners. So I would highly recommend these bags and I will link them below. Now it's time for a nice warm shower and I just purchased this native cashmere and rain body wash and the smell is so lovely like they picked the perfect name for this body wash. On Sundays my shower routine is a little more detailed because I have more time so I like to do things like use a body scrub or a body polish and definitely if I need to shave I'm doing that because I just have more time I feel like I'm not being rushed so that's what I am doing here
y'all, I was so hungry at this point because I don't know if y'all are the same, but when I know I have to clean and do stuff around the house, I do not really eat. Like I have my coffee. I'm like that at work. I'll drink my coffee and that's pretty much it. But I was starting to feel weak. So I just ate a couple pieces of bacon before I continued. So this is my junk drawer. This drawer has looked like this for years. And on this Sunday, I decided I wanted to finally organize it. Plus I have bought some organizers from Amazon. So this is gonna be like my skincare and hair care drawer for like all the products that I'm always using. And I just want it in one location. So that's what this drawer is gonna be. But I'm definitely gonna buy some more of these little organizers from Amazon because they come in clutch. <music> Once you clean one part of whatever you're cleaning, it's like you want to clean everything else. So I decided to clean the other two drawers. I didn't have any organizers for them, but they were filled with crap that I'm never going to use. So I just got rid of a bunch of old hair care products. I can take it like must admit that I do not clean out my hair brushes like I should so I have committed to myself that once a week I'm going to clean them out because you know you're using your hair brushes frequently all your dirty hair is in it all the product buildup is in it and when your hair is clean at least for me I'm grabbing for that same dirty hair brush and using it on my clean hair which just makes no sense so Definitely going to have this in my schedule on Sundays to make sure all of my hair tools are clean. thing I like to do is just wipe around the toilet and the back of it with some Clorox wipes as well as the wall because you just don't know how many germs are in that area so I like to at least once a week just disinfect that area and make sure that everything is clean <laughs>
of mine is hair all over the floor, especially in the bathroom and my hair gets everywhere. So now that I've cleaned the counters and everything off in the bathroom, I'm just gonna go over with my favorite tool, my Dyson and just get up all the hair that's on my carpet. And I swear I probably do this once a day because I cannot even stand the littlest strand to be on my bathroom floor. time to chill and do a little gratitude journaling as well as I like to sit and take a few minutes to organize my week and write out some ideas that I have or like appointments and things I have going on. So that's what I'm doing here. I really like this gratitude journal. When I bought it on Amazon, I thought that it was blank and you basically just write whatever you want, but there's actual um, questions and things like that in this journal. So I would recommend it because I was wondering why it was almost $20, but now I know. Um, and I like to do this on Sundays because it, you know, just puts you in the right perspective and ready to go for the week. And I love organizing my week so that, you know, I'm not all feeling all over the place with my thoughts. I know every day what I have going on. And lastly, I'm just gonna scroll a little on Pinterest. If you know, that's where I get inspired. Love, love, love Pinterest. So I'm just gonna spend a few hours getting inspired, thinking of ideas for the following week. And then that's it. Then I'm just gonna make my Sunday dinner and chill out because everything's done. And I literally got up at like, eight o'clock I want to say this Sunday and I was pretty much done with everything by about one or two o'clock so that just goes to show that getting up early starting your day early then you have more hours in the day to just chill because everything was done early so really really enjoy this Sunday so if you guys um, enjoyed the video let me know below make sure that you like this video if you are new here what's up welcome to the bjd gang gang go ahead and hit that subscribe button i love you all i hope you all are doing well and as always i will see y'all in the next video peace